I think Pepper might be in labor. She's been walking around, um, making this really strange sound, kind of cooing the babies that are already here. We're gonna go ahead and put the ducks and chickens up for the night and um, give her some, give her some peace. All right, come on chickens, let's go to bed. Come on chickens. Come on chickens. Go to bed. Go on. Go to bed. Chickens. Good chickens. Nice All right, everyone in their house. Good night, guys. All right, mamas. Yeah, there you go. We put the chickens and ducks up so it'll be a little bit quieter for you. Yes. Oh, I know, baby. Oh, I set up uh, Mocha and Maple back here with some food to distract them so they'll stay back here. And that'll give Pepper some peace and quiet. <laughs> the babies. <laughs> oh my gosh, you see what the babies are doing. What are you guys doing over here? Huh? Oh, are you guys about to make like a cuddle pile? Oh, you look like you're about to make a cuddle pile. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, what's that? What was that? You just did a flop. You said, ah. Oh. So, so dramatic. Hi there, sweetheart. Oh, you're such a sleepy head. Oh my goodness, feel those little buds coming in. Hi there, sweetheart. What are you doing? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Pepper, you are such a fatty. Even in labor, you have to eat. Yes, you have to eat, don't you? You are such a chomp. How you doing, mamas? Yeah, see, this is what she's been doing for the last 10 minutes. Yeah, just making this chitter sound. What are you doing? That's not your baby, though. Hi, baby. That's so good, mama. You're doing so good. Yes, I saw you wanting to love on them babies all of a sudden. You'll have your baby soon, don't worry. You'll have your baby soon. You'll have it. I know, mamas. It's coming. It's coming. You're working on it. You're working on it, honey. I'm here for you. Just kind of hanging out. Um, unfortunately, I don't have the truck with me. And I'm afraid to leave and go get the truck to get the trailer and bring her home. And by the time I get back, she's had the babies. <laughs> I don't want to miss it. So I'm just kind of uh, hanging out with her. She's, she's up and down right now, which is good. I saw her pawn earlier, so that's, that's pretty much the signs. And she's been making, she's been doing these, she's been crying out even though everyone's here. <laughs> Going for a walk. Oh, yep, there comes some of the liquid. They're literally like right there. You can see them on the other side. Oh my goodness, what are you babies doing? They have claimed this salt block holder as their bed. They love sleeping out here. Let me make this a little bit flatter for you. There you go, that better. There you go, now you can lay in it. Maple. There you go. She's doing, she's showing major interest in the babies. I know, mamas. She's just talking to them. Hi, sweetheart. Hi. Hi, baby. Hi, 
baby. Still working on getting names together for these guys. So while we wait for Pepper to continue to labor out, I'll go ahead and introduce you. So this is one of Maple's little bucklings. She had two of them. We have one that looks just like Maple and he's extra fuzzy. Oh, and then right on cue, we have Maple's other little buckling and he is, uh, oh, watch out. He is like a tan color and he's extra sweet. And then this funky one back here is Mocha's single little doling, little girl. And uh, she's, we're, we're loving her. We might actually keep her. I don't like it, but she's extra lovey-dovey and sweet. Yes. Oh, hi. Oh, you guys are just loving on me, huh? Hi. So we're collecting names right now. And uh, then we'll have you guys, hi. Then we'll have you guys vote on the names for them. We're not sure who's gonna stay and who's gonna go quite yet, but we'll uh, announce that down the road. Hi babies. I'm kind of just getting to know them, seeing their personalities. You can't eat that. That's not edible. That's not edible. Hi Pepper. You can't fit in there. you did to your nose, honey, but your nose looks bad. Be nice to her. What did you do to your nose? Yes, what did you do to your nose? What are you doing down here? Oh my gosh, I got the three troublemakers. You guys are the three troublemakers, huh? Yes. Oh, but you guys are so sweet. Oh, hi. Hi. Yes, Pepper, I know mamas. What are you doing? Hi. You're so curious. And so sweet. Yes, you are just so sweet. <laughs> oh, what? 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 <laughs> no. working on it, mamas. You got it, Pepper. You got it, baby. Yes, I know. What are you doing in there? Huh? What are you doing in there? Oh, and here comes another. You guys are like, oh, I know, honey. Flopsy and all over the place. So she has a habit of flopping. We, we, we've been joking around calling her Flopsy. Hi, 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 hi. So we went ahead and loaded Pepper up in the trailer just because she kept trying to uh, mother the babies. So she was licking baby mocha, so we went ahead and put her up in the trailer. How you doing, mamas? Here, I'm gonna come in here and hang out with you, okay? So you're not lonely. I know, you're lonely. There you go. I know, baby. I know. I'm in here with you, mamas. I know, honey. 
Hi, baby. I know. I'm in here with you. Yes, I know. I'm here with you, mamas. I'm just gonna hang out with you. Yes, baby, I know. That's a good girl. I know, Pepper. I know, baby. You just don't want to be alone. I know, mamas. It's okay. You're good in here, baby. So we are hanging out in the trailer. She stood antsy for a little bit, but I think now that I'm in here and she's not alone, she's calming down. She finally laid down. Isn't that right, Pepper? You feel a little bit calmer now? You good now? Yeah, you look calmer. She's totally not happy with me for putting her in here. She's like, I wanted to stay with the babies. The babies are cute. I want to love on the babies. Well, you're going to have more babies of your own to love on. Hopefully soon. You won't have them babies because I don't want to be here all night. And I'm afraid to leave to go get the truck to bring you home because I'm afraid you're going to pop them babies out while I'm gone. I could have been go I could have gone and been back with the truck. Okay. We're both here now. All right, so Davis is on his way out with the truck. We're still sitting in here and uh, just uh, gonna wait for Davis to come out because it's getting late and we have no drinks or anything like that out here. And it's gonna get dark, so we're gonna go ahead and hook up the uh, trailer to the truck and haul her home and let her spend the night in the backyard so we can monitor her. And um, I guess we're gonna be up late tonight with babies. You better have babies this time. This is the second time she's done this where she her, it felt like her ligaments were soft. So we brought her home and I was literally up every hour checking on her and no babies. And then I checked her and her ligaments weren't soft. So I don't know, but um, false alarm. False alarm. So we're, are you gonna actually have them this time? Have your gentle, babies. Gentle, 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 so pretty babies. They're so mamas. So, but she's, She's pretty soft. I don't feel, I really don't feel ligaments, so. Go ahead them babies, mamas. I know, baby. I know. Yes, what? Oh, you wanna come sit over here? That's such a good girl. Oh, she being so sweet. Hi, mamas. What? Want scratches? They're not actually very good brands to scratch over. They're good. Oh, yes. Just being sweet on me over here. Uh-huh. Uh, this won't come out. You know, stop. Still nothing on the back end, though. What? We'll have your babies. Yeah. We'll have your babies. Now. Just help them. Right now. You're trying to... Be oh, I know, baby. I'm so lonely. I, I tried to let you labor out with them, but then you wanted to live on, on babies that aren't yours. Oh. 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 oh, we gonna have something? Here, uh, come on. No, stop, stop, stop. I'll show her. I'm just showing her to the water. Come here, baby. She'll follow me. Come here, baby. Come here, baby. Come on, baby. Yes. See, it seems like I'm some sort of comfort for her. Come here. Look, here's some water. See? Look, here's some water. There you, you go. Got shoes you got on. I am barefoot. Well, you're the one who didn't wear shoes out here. Yeah, there you I go, didn't mamas. Have socks Is that good? Whenever you got whenever some water? I went out. There you go. Get a good drink. Oh, yeah. That's good. So it is uh, 11.30 and uh, she still hasn't 
had any major progress. She's just kind of been moving around, up and down. Hi, Mama, as I know. Yes, yeah, so just kind of hanging out with her. Those are my sandals. No, you can't eat those. <laughs> Poor mamas. I know, baby. So we're going to just kind of keep watching her. I'll be checking in on her throughout the night. So finishing up at the vet's house, thankfully we found a vet that would let us bring her to them. Um, unfortunately, um, so basically what happened was the baby, whenever she started to deliver the baby, it had presented its front feet out and its head bent backwards along its spine and it had gotten stuck at its shoulders. And um, so we the vet we got the vet he we had to pull the baby unfortunately it was already dead by the time i i had even gotten there it was it was already passed unfortunately because the sack had had broken and there's no telling how long it was stuck like that but pepper's pepper's doing okay we got to monitor her now and just make sure she doesn't have a prolapse but we gave her something for the pain and now we're and uh, he gave her something to help her pass the placenta so we're just kind of waiting and watching but, um, but yeah, so we're just gonna kind of monitor her. My baby, she's just resting right now, letting her rest. She hasn't passed the placenta yet, but he gave her some, I think he said oxytocin to help her uterine co co contract so that she can pass it. But she said that because she uh, stood up pretty easily after everything that he doesn't think she'll have any problems. Because after he, after he pulled the baby, she, we let her rest for a little bit, and then we got her up to clean her off, and I set her down, and she stood right up and went, started walking. So. Hi, Mama. I'm so sorry, baby. She, I feel so bad because she really wanted a baby. She was literally licking mo baby Mocha and, like, cooing to them and calling them when she, she was in labor. She could adopt one of those two. Yeah. That's so good, Mama. It wouldn't hurt for them to get that colostrum out of her either. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit more helpful for them, especially Mocha's baby. I mean, one thought is we could try and bring back the little tan buckling, bring him here and see if maybe she'll adopt him. I don't know if that's, I don't know how Maple would <laughs> be accepting of that. I guess they would just hang out here for a few days, let him nursing her if she'll even, if she'll even if let, she'll him. let him. Yeah. Watch that, see if she'll so, even let him. I would be monitored. Just because she licks him doesn't mean she's going to let him nurse. Mm -hmm. yeah, we'll have to see. Just let you rest, mamas. You'll just get some rest, okay, baby?